MTD CNC, bringing you the latest engineering news, reviews, events, and special offers via video media. Dominic, quite aptly named, we've got the Dominator here from Matsura. What actually is this? What we've got? What we've got, um, Paul, is, is basically a modular pallet system that, with the success of the MX520 that we've had over the last three years, a lot of our clients are asking us for automation. Being an automation provider, um, we've been thinking, how can we be different in the market? What can we give the customer to be different in their own marketplace? So the Dominator from Cellro is basically a modular system that allows the MX to be fully automated, not only with pallets, but also with tools. This particular offering that we've got here at our open house today has got 28 pallets and 56 tools that we can interchange as the machine is obviously producing a part, we can change tools. So, so that tool changer is, so you don't have to go for a bigger tool changer on the machine, you can utilize the flexibility of the cell row to have more tools. Correct, yeah, standard now on the MX520 is 60, 60 tools and we now actually offer 90 tools as an option on the magazine, which was launched at Emo just a, a month or so ago. But what we can now do is obviously offer even more tools. So as the, the Dominator is, a, is a, a system, it's more a, a cellular manufacturing system, with intelligence where we can have different components utilising a lot of tools, we can now expand the tool magazine very simply by changing the gripper on the robot and changing tools in the magazine whilst it's actually producing a component. There's lots of uh, robotic automation in the market where you can change pallets on machines and equally there is where you can change tools uh, in machines but there's not a lot that combine the two so is this unique? This is unique and this was the attraction to us so that when we started discussing with Celro to give us something that's unique and different to market to have a tool changing system and a pallet changing system all in one is quite, is quite unique and then What's, very, what's really nice about the system is it's designed to be, again, expandable. So we can expand the system to have even more tools, another 56 or 112, or another 12 or 24 pallets, and then expand it further with a second machine. So is there any limitations on that front? Can you, can you go to whatever size you require? We can do, but what we want to do at the moment is, is purely focus on the MX520. We've got a, a big installation base now that we can revisit and obviously get our customer base to think about automating their existing machine and then to expand it to a second machine. That's a good point. So if I, was, if, if I bought a machine off of you last year, could I come to you now and install this solution on a standard machine? Absolutely, and that's the whole point, is that what we're trying to do is to give our small customer, the medium and the large, the option to expand what they've already got. So if they already have the investment to go to phase two, which is to put the dominator on, it's obviously a small stepping stone. And then that leads them into the, the second machine, which means then they create a, an FMS, an FMC, in bite-sized chunks as they recoup their investment. So the intelligence behind this, if I had two machines, they would know, or the robotics would know, which is in where, which pallet's in where, which tool to get from which side to go in which machine. They'd work in unison, would they? Absolutely, and that is the key. The key is that the system is a cell controller. So it knows where the tools are, where the pallets are, where the jobs are scheduled, and it will change tools accordingly. And if required, it will take tools out of one machine and put them in the other machine to manufacture that component. And is there any restriction? I see you've got tools on the left-hand side here. Could the tools be on the right and the pallets be on the left or vice versa? Absolutely. So we can bespoke the system within reason. Okay, we're trying to keep the options simple so that obviously it makes it easier to interface and much quicker to be up and running at the customer side. I mean, this is Matsura through and through. This must be ideal or a dream for you. Is this, is this exactly what you wanted at the start of the year? Yeah, this is, this is my brainchild. And, and working with Cellro, it's, you know, we had a long meeting at Cellro back in February, and it's fantastic that it's here today to be launched in our open house. I don't want to forget during this interview the machine, because it's a massive part of the solution. How much success have you had with this MX520? Well, the MX520 for us, and not only us, but Matsura globally, is Matsura's best-selling machine. The fact that we've got all the technology that we have in our MAM technology in the MX at an affordable price, obviously sub 200,000, and we are offering the machine at, you know, at the 149 that we've been doing for as a promotional year. 
we have grown our new user base significantly because of this machine. I have to pick you up on that, 150 grand for the MX520. Yeah, as its basic form with some five axis capability. But obviously, you know, as we have evolved the product, you know, I think a lot of, a lot of our customers, is, do you have A or do you have B or do you have a premium product? And we're not that far away. Brilliant. Thank you, Dom. Enjoy the show. Thank you very much. Thanks for coming. For more videos, products and news, go to mtdcnc.com or follow MTD Online on Twitter.